For Mashable, I'm Lauren Gorris. The iBrain is not an Apple product, but NeuroVigil's device could change the way people, like those with neurodegenerative diseases, communicate. The device was created as the simple, minimalist alternative to the wire-heavy neural monitoring machines used to test for conditions like sleep apnea, depression, and autism. Dr. Philip Lowe, neuroscientist and CEO of NeuroVigil, tells MSNBC what the iBrain can do. We're able to produce maps of brain activity from a single EEG. Now, that's never been done before. But Lowe sees a more revolutionary use for his eye brain. As the New York Times reports, the company is working with physicist Stephen Hawking, whose ability to communicate diminishes as his Lou Gehrig's disease progresses. Their hope? To give Hawking, and those like him, a way to communicate by just thinking. Hawking currently uses this system that picks up twitches in his cheek to generate a message. But as Dr. Harry Hyman Patterson tells the Times, Patients want to be able to communicate beyond the yes or no with an eye blink. They want to send an email and turn off the light and, even more, to have a meaningful conversation. So the researchers are using the brain signals the eye brain picks up and interpreting them with an algorithm created by Lowe for his PhD in 2007. Lowe still has plenty of work ahead of him. Hawking told the Times his cheek switch is quicker, but if Lowe's system proves itself, he would give it a try. For Mashable, I'm Lauren Gorris.